السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس ماں صلی اللہ فرد ماگرے آج ہم پڑھنے جا رہے ہیں نان وربل کمیونیکیشن آئی ایم دا موسٹ امپورٹنٹ اسپیکر ان دا ورلڈ بیکاز ایوری ورڈ ایوری گیسچر اینڈ ایوری ٹاٹ ہیز بین کیئرفلی ریہرسل جارج بینر شاہ نان وربل کمیونیکیشن نان وربل کمیونیکیشن از ایکول ٹو کمیونیکیشن وداؤٹ ورڈس نان وربل کمیونیکیشن از اے پروسیس آف کمیونیکیشن تھرو سینڈنگ اینڈ ریسیونگ ورڈ لیس میسیج Now the communication, it's a possible to communicate without words. Studies show that our half of our message is carried through non-verbal elements, your appearance, your body language, your tune, and the pace of your voice. Now the communication, we know that importance of first impression, but first impression happens every time we initiate the communication before someone process our verbal message. She has taken in our appearance, registered our enthusiasm, and sincerity note our tune of voice and proceed all into verbal messages now the message a normal communication between people is people is communication through sending and receiving wordless clues include the use of visual cues such as body language kinesis distances proximity and physical environment appearance of voice pair language and of touch hepatics it can also include chronomics the use of time and oculuses eye contact and the option of looking while talking and listening frequency of glance patterns and fixation pupil dilation and blink rate neural communication involves the conscious and unconscious process of encoding and decoding encoding is act generating information such as facial expression gestures and postures decoding the interpretation of information from received sensation from previous experiences posture men article posture psychology there are many different types of body positioning body positioning to portray certain postures include slouching towering leg spread jaw thrust thrust shoulders forward on arm crossing the postures of body sentences repeated by individuals communicates a variety of messages whether good or bad gestures gestures may be made with the hands and arms or body also include movements of the head face and eyes such as winking nodding or rolling one's eye although the study of gesture is still in its infancy some broad categories of gestures have been identified by researchers the most familiar are also called emblem or quotable gesture these are conventional culture specific gestures that can be used as a replacement of words such as the hand wave used in western cultures for hello and goodbye single emblematic gesture can have very different significance in different cultural extents ranging from compliment to highly offensive the like body gestures facial expression face shows feelings attitudes and emotions degree of facial expression are determined by cultures people from united states shows emotions more than their asian inter- counterparts facial expressions are show to be similar all over the world but people from different classes cultures do not show it in public the meaning of these are commonly acknowledged everywhere too much expression is taken to be shallow in some places where in some it's taken as being weak happiness surprise fear disgust anger sadness and neutral